you guys have a slightly older car like me, mine's from 2001, you may notice that your heater performance in the winter isn't what it used to be. And uh, it's mostly due to buildup of various contaminants and particulates in your heater core that accumulate in the thin passages. So one of the ways to clean it is, well, to replace it. But otherwise, um, you can flush it as well. And I've tried flushing it with uh, hot water and using um, like a, a clean solution, like the Prestone um, flush. However, um, cycling it through is the difficulty. So what I have here are some three quarter inch hoses that I connected to my heater core. And I've been reverse flushing it with something as simple as a $20 aquarium pump. I'm going to skip the details of how to access or access, access your heater core um, since every model is slightly different. But in my example, uh, I just had to remove two hoses and they are three quarter inch ID hoses, which makes it very simple with my aquarium pump since it comes with three quarter inch hose fittings. So what I'm gonna do is just place the hoses in here, plug in the pump to my trouble light outlet here. And off it goes. So I already let this soak, well actually cycle with the uh, Prestone or whatever your favorite brand would be um, flushing solution. Uh, and I did that for about, I don't know, four hours or so. I just went and ran some errands while this was sitting here. And I used hot water because one of the recommendations is to put it in your car and then uh, get it up to operating temperature. But now I'm actually uh, rinsing all that solution out and using just some soft water so you don't have too much uh, iron and other contaminants in there. Eventually I'm going to fill this with distilled water and, and coolant. But you can see this is about the, the third time I've emptied out the water. And this bucket was clean. And you can see at the bottom that there are still more particulates coming out. It's a little bit difficult to see because I don't know how well the camera's focusing on those particulates. But um, it's enough that I think a few more rounds of either... Um, draining the water and replacing it with something new we'll, we'll probably get it clean enough such that it'll work for the rest of the winter if not uh, a few more seasons because I really really do not want to replace my heater core it's about a 20 hour job I have to pull the whole dashboard apart to get to it it's, uh, it's a real pain so anyway if you have um, some hoses and like I said a $20 heater pump I, or aquarium pump I bought this one on Amazon. It's about 400 gallons per uh, per hour, I believe. And it like I said it came with the the right size adapter or fittings that you just screw into the pump. So if yours isn't working, try this and good luck.